everyone, welcome to Collection TV. Today we're going to take a look at the new 2015 Tokyo Race 7 car gift pack only at Target from Disney Pixar Cars 2. This has one exclusive vehicle which is Lewis Hamilton's crew chief Bruce Boxman. You can uh, pause to look at all the cars on the back. And there's also a description, which if it'll focus, you can pause and read. I'm going to open these guys up, and then I will review them once I get them out. Okay, so here they all are out of the package. We have seven cars. We have Shu Todoroki, Max Schnell, Jeff Corvette, Lewis Hamilton, Bruce Boxman, Denise Bean, and Frank Clutchinson. We'll look at each of these individually on the turntable, ending with Bruce Boxman. So if you only are only watching this video to see him, you might scan through the video a little bit till closer to the end. But I will review all seven cars. We'll start with Max Schnell because I think he's probably the least exciting car in this set. He's still pretty cool, it's just that he's been in a lot of sets as well as one packs lately, so most Cars collectors already do have him. All these cars are 155 scale die cast made by Mattel, and none of them have paper stickers. Here's Shu Todoroki. He's from Japan. He has the rising sun on him, as well as number sevens, World Grand Prix logos, and many other things, and the kind of dragon logo for Japan. Here is Jeff Corvette, which is a pretty cool car. He's a Corvette. That's pretty cool. I must say that he's a pretty cool race car, although most people also have this one, as well as Shu and Max. So if you've been collecting for the last three or four years, you probably have these. Here is Lewis Hamilton. He must be, he's probably one of my favorite World Grand Prix racers. And also one of the last ones that came out right before Rip Kuchgonski. So there were 11 racers. This one was the 10th one released. So he was kind of rare when he first came out. But he's been in a lot of sets since then. Here's Frank Clutchinson, who is a Francesco fan. And he pretty much remained the same. Unfortunately, he's not a unibody. Except that now... The little segment piece is metal, where I guess on the previous release, this mouthpiece was plastic. So it's a little bit of an upgrade, but I'd rather it be an up a unibody, though, than a two-piece car. Here is Denise Beam. This was probably one of the main reasons I wanted to get this set, was because she has been upgraded to a unibody, or one piece, which is always exciting to get. Here is her old release, and you can, if I zoom in, you might be able to see that this one is one piece, where this one has a slit right there above the grill. So, kind of different. Not too much change, but it is always nice to get a upgrade on a car. And last but not least is Bruce Boxman. Now, most people thought this would be the Bob Cutlass body, including me. But he's actually quite a bit different. Um, they really could have used the same body. I'm not exactly sure why they made a new one. I honestly think that Bob Cutlass's body would probably have been more accurate. But I guess that's okay. Um, he's a really cool die cast though. I really like the headset because the headset is like really big on him. And the fact that they made it all black or pretty much all the other ones, they kind of just made black with like the silver, even though in the movies they're like kind of the color of the race car, so it's cool that they kind of did that finally for this one, and um, of course the Brian Gierluski, I think that's his name, is Brian Gierluski, will be coming out with Rip Kuchgonski this year, although he wasn't actually in the movie, he is Rip Kuchgonski's crew chief, and so we now have, other than Brian Gierluski, we pretty much have all the World Grand Prix racers, crew chiefs that are that will come out by the end of this year. Hopefully, some they'll finally release um, Autobahn and Max Schnell together someday. But um, 
course, that's only hope, but that would be the last crew chief that was actually in Cars 2 if they would just make it, so hopefully someday they will. Well, thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you next time. This is Henry Motorcoop. Bye.